Hey peoples, Gamestar8000 back with another video. And today we're continuing our Pokemon Yellow Nuzlocke. As you all might remember, last time we made it through the routes and we got Koga's Gym Badge. And today we're going through Sylphco. Anyway, you know what we do every time we start off one of these episodes. Let's show off the team. We have Puff. The same as always. We have Phlox. The same as always. We have Ton. The same as always. We have Shronid. The same. We have Female Sign. He's the, she's the same. And we have Goat. Who is the same. But anyway, today we are going through Sylphco. And while I talk, I'm just going to sort through my stuff. Anyway. But anyway, Sylphco, right. Well, actually, first I'm going to put some items away. So I have room for items that will get in Sylphco. But anyway, the reason I'm recording Sylphco is because you all wanted me to. I wasn't going to record Sylphco because I thought it would be boring and a waste of time, but you guys wanted it, so I'm here to provide. Uh, let's put away Corn Case. I don't need that right now. Poke Flute. Uh, revives, are, uh, revives are worthless, but I'll keep it in just in case I want to sell it. Channel 4, I don't need. Keep the super out in case, and I don't want toxic. And there we go. But anyway, yeah, we're going through Silco. And guess what? Not only are we going through Silco on this episode, but we'll probably be doing some more of Silco next episode. Because I have an issue where every time I, every time I play this game, I fight every single trainer I see. It's kind of thing with me. I don't know why. I don't like skipping trainers. But anyway, I'm pretty sure this is Sylphco, right? Yeah, Sylphco. Ta-da. And now we have to deal with this music for the next half hour. So I'm just going to go in the elevator to show you guys Sylphco. Gosh darn it. To show you guys, Sylphco has a number of nine floors. What? Eleven? Eleven floors, that's even worse. So yeah, we'll be going through all these floors and fighting every single rocket grind. So yeah, this will be fun. If you guys don't want me to do this, you can put it down in the comments. If you guys just don't want to see me go through Sylphco, I'll do it in my spare time. And I will start recording when I have to fight Blue. And Giovanni. Because then you guys won't have to watch this. Because let me tell you right now, it is this is going to be very boring. Especially since all the poke, the enemy's Pokemon are very low level compared to ours. So, just thought I'd let you know. Switch that out for Taunt. Since Taunt's level 39. I'd say our Pokemon will get up to level 42 or 43 when we complete this. So... At least we'll have higher level Pokemon, I guess. I don't know. And when we finish this, which will probably be next episode, we will go on to fight Sabrina. Then we'll go through the Seafoam Islands, get to Blaine, then Giovanni, then the Blue fight, because I can't remember if I've done that already. Then we'll go through Victory Road. I think it's called Victory Road, right? Victory Road. I'm pretty sure it's Victory Road. I can't remember. And then we'll do the Elite Four. Then we'll f do that. Then we'll fight Mewtwo. And then we'll be done. But, uh, a thing about this Nuzlocke I'd like to say. If you like this Nuzlocke, cool. But, uh, this will probably be the only one I do. I just find it very boring. The only way I'd think about doing this again is if you guys want me to stream it. If you guys want to see me stream, comment down below, because I don't want to stream unless people want me to. But if you do, I'll do it. 
but I won't be doing it on YouTube. I'll probably do it on Twitch. I do have a Twitch account, but I don't stream. But that can change very quickly if you guys want. Just comment it down below. I'll try to fit it into my schedule. What's up, Voltor? Get out of my face. Bye. Oh, you're alive. Okay. Apparently, Magneton's a pretty bulky Pokemon. I don't really know because I mean I guess, but I don't, I didn't really look at my Magneton stats. I'll do that right now. Nothing else to do. Well, you know that is a pretty high defense, I think. Let's just let's just use Shrine for comparison. Okay. Bad comparison. Shrouded is better in every way. But yeah, if you all want, you can just skip this episode because, like I said, all I'm doing is going through, uh. going through Silphco. I'm pretty sure we won't be doing anything exciting today. Ow, my head hurts. So yeah, if you guys want to change your mind and tell me to do this in my spare time, I'll do it. I don't really mind. It's just kind of hard to think of commentary in Silphco. Anyway. Walking around in a green building. I'm sorry I meant yellow. I'm have trouble speaking. I'm singing to this very boring and sad song. And floor two's done. Nice. That's one floor, I guess. Ooh, I know something I would like, I guess. But it probably won't happen. I know this will seem very dumb, but a thing I've wanted for a long while is uh, someone to make a ROM hack with Pokemon Yellow, but don't do anything. Just fix the colors. For example, make Raticate brown, and uh, change some of the colors of the towns because Yellow is not a good color. I love the color yellow, but it is not good for everything. It's a color that you use to just brighten it up. Like, uh, for example... What's a good example? Shuckle. All, not all of Shuckle is yellow. To be honest, when I look at Shuckle, I notice the red first, and the yellow brings out the red, in my opinion. I like that. It's not all yellow, but a pretty good portion of it's yellow. Uh, what's another good example? Um, just don't make something all yellow. It, it, sometimes it hurts people's eyes because of how bright it is. Oh, hey, what's up? I thought you were a guy I have to fight. Oh yeah, uh, another thing I'd like you guys to comment, if possible, do you guys care if I make noise during these recordings, like, when there's nothing exciting happen happening, do you care if I just whistle or whatever? Because I've heard that some people get irritated with whistling, it hurts their ears or they just don't like it. I love whistling, but if you guys don't want me to do it, I won't. Especially here, because it'll be a lot of high-pitched whistling. I'm gonna check the camera, make sure everything's getting recorded. Everything seems fine. Oh, yeah. A uh, little thing I've been wanting to say. Uh, 
I may be getting a job soon, so uh, I may record less. Maybe, maybe. But if I get a job, my uh, the quality of my content may get better. I could buy more plushes for props. I could buy a tripod for my phone. I could buy a if I save up enough money. I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. I hit the wrong button. But if I save enough money, I could buy a PC, maybe a monitor, get a capture card, maybe make all this look a bit nicer. Heck, I might even record using an emulator. I, in my opinion, I do not like using emulators, unless I already own the game in question. For example... I would probably use an emulator on Pokemon Yellow, but I probably wouldn't on Red and Blue. Because I want to I wanna play it normally first, then I'd use an emulator. You know what I mean? Also, it doesn't feel like I'm cheating someone out of their money. Even if this is a 20 year old game. Also, I've been thinking. I may swap something out for Ton. Ton, he's a good Pokemon, but all he has is Thunderbolt. Let's just face it. You're not bringing much to the table, Ton. I could get other Pokemon that are electric types and have more moves. Like, um... I think Electabuzz can learn Mega Punch and Mega... Wait, I already used those teams. I don't really know. I'm pretty sure some Electric types can learn more than just Thunderbolt. I'm obviously not talking about Zapdos because... I'm not using any Legendaries. That seems like I'm cheating the game and it's going to be very boring. So if y'all were hoping me to waltz, waltz through uh, the Elite Four with my Zapdos, Moltres, and Articuno... No, I'm sorry. That is not fun, in my opinion. But, uh, I may swap out Ton. For example, maybe I'll use Snorlax. Give it Rest, Amnesia, Surf. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny having a special Snorlax set. Oh, no. Well, I hope you guys don't have trouble with this, because I am not going to a Pokemon Center. What's this? Pokemon Report. Blah, 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 blah. Four Pokemon evolve only. I'm going to see if that's right. Kadabra. Graveler. Haunter. Kadabra. Gravel. Kadabra. Graveler. Haunter. Hmm. Hold up. Kadabra, Graveler, Haunter, Machoke. Hmm. Is there really not another one that evolves by doing that? Uh. Well, you know, I think it's right. I can't think of anything. What's this say? Uh... Pokemon Port, blah, 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 blah. I don't care. Oh, yeah, Porygon's in this game. If you all don't know, I actually really like Porygon. One of my favorite Pokemon, to be honest. I gotta keep watch on Tons HP. I'd say when it gets to around... 40... I'll go and try and heal him, because I don't want to take a risk of losing Ton. Or who knows, maybe I have something that'll heal Ton of his uh, poison ailment, and I'll just do that. This wasn't very well thought out. Eh, I'll survive.
You're doing great, Ton. Switch to Tronin. And sorry, scientist, you just lost all your Pokemon. Let's check the time on the video. Alright, 15 minutes. So this recording's halfway done. Let's use a slashy slash. Dang, Weezing's a bulky Pokemon. You know, I'm just gonna use Rock Slide. Sandslash? Oops. Sandslash is gonna be amazing, in my opinion. With it knowing Slash, Rock Slide. When I level it up a bit more, I'm pretty sure it'll learn Earthquake. The only problem is, I really need to think of a better move than Poison Sting. Alright, let's see if we have anything to heal Poison. I do not. I don't think I do, at least. So, uh, Super Potion him. Perfect. Again, sorry for the flashiness, if that irritates you. I'm gonna finish this floor, and then I'll go heal. Actually, no. You know what? Since this is gonna be nothing but battles, I'm just gonna leave him poisoned. And, uh, when there's, like, five minutes left on the video, I'm probably going to go and heal him, since we won't deal with the flashing very much, in my opinion. Again, like I said, I'm sorry if this irritates you, and also, if it hurts your eyes, you can always just not watch the video, because this is pretty much just a filler episode. Give me that key card. floors we've gone up so far. I can't remember. I'd say this is floor 5. I'm gonna check. Elevator, tell me which floor I'm on. Gosh darn it. I'll just have to do this, I guess. Alright, we're at floor 6. We're halfway done. Nice. I'm one of the four Rocket Brothers. I don't really care, brother. Ooh, I'm a chop. How about my chop? I love this ton. I'm pretty sure he's sporty. Oh, hey, I'm a choke. Something a choke. Okay, Ton is now useless. Uh, let's go with Phlox. Did you guys ever notice that Machop has a baby face in this game? Like, I find it hilarious. Just look at him. He has a Machop face on all that buff, and it's hilarious, to, in my opinion. Anyway, time to take Ton out of the front because he's garbage. Go get him, Puff. You're my pride and joy. If you all don't know, I play Smash a lot. I do Smash content sometimes. And, uh, I use a lot of Jigglypuff. So... As a result, I, I like Jigglypuff. Also, Wigglytuff can learn a lot of moves. Just it's like a it's like a uh, worse version of Mew in that regard. You name a move, it can probably learn it. For example, it can learn Surf, Thunderbolt, Fire Blast. 
bubble beam, I think. I know it's another water pulse. Uh, seismic toss, thunder wave, psychic. Heck, I might look at his stats again, and if he has a real... Actually, no, no, I'll keep Body Slam. Body Slam's a really good move. But, say Puff had Garbage Attack and Amazing Special, I would get rid of Body Slam for something like Surf. Let's see how Ton doing. Okay, Ton's at 37. If y'all are wondering why I'm not opening any doors even though I've gotten the card key. What I'm doing is uh, I'm going to go through the entire, the entirety of Silphco. Then I'm going to go through it again, but open every single door. Then I'll go fight Blue. If y'all don't like the way I play, I'm sorry. As I said, this is a filler episode, so... If you want, just click off. I'm not going to stop you. This is pretty boring. Oh, boy. A po person with five Pokemon. Video's got nine minutes left. I'm going to check the camera. Make sure it's recording everything. I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, yeah. I've been thinking about something recently. Do you guys like the plushes or not? I personally like them. It gives my content... I think it makes my content a little bit more unique. Because not many people use plushes as props from what I've seen. I mean, most people use capture cards, so... But since I can't afford it, I use plushes to make it look a little nicer. I was wondering, do you guys want to keep the plush set up? Or would you want me to try to zoom in more on the gameplay? Because number one priority of this is trying to make you all happy. If none of you comment, I'm going to keep the plush. If nobody comments, I'm going to keep the plush set up. But if you do want me to change it, just comment down below. Uh, okay. Hey, another rocket brother. I don't care, brother. You ready to get gamered on? I don't know. Bye bye. Whoosh. When Puff levels up, I'll see your stats. Cause I can't. I forgot to look at him when she leveled up till 41. Let's see your stats. Oh hey, you survived. I just realized. Psychic? Yeah, it's a great move, but I just realized it's even better. It's even better because it lowers the special stat. I didn't know it did I didn't know it did that. If you all don't know, the special stat is one single stat in this game. And uh Some Pokemon benefit very greatly from that. Let me start that over. Many Pokemon benefit very well, and some of them get really low-balled. For example, Alakazam. Crap, I forgot to look at the stats. Alakazam. You all may know Alakazam as a fast, a fast glass cannon. In this game, he's fast, he hits hard, and he's a tank because of the special stat being one stat. Or Hitmonchan. Hitmonchan, yeah, he's a pretty bad Pokemon. I love him. I like using him. But he's not that great. And in this game, he's even worse because the special stat being one stat, he doesn't have that amazing base 115 special defense. He has a base 30 special attack and a special, bleh, a base 30 special attack and a base 30 special defense because of this, because of special being one stat and it sucks. You guys want some goat gameplay? 
Here you go. I wish there was a bed in this place. I don't think there are beds in Gen 1. You fight. No, I knew you were a person that fights. Almost, like, half the scientists in this place fight you. Oh, hey, it's Mr. Self-Destruct himself. I don't think I have anything to worry about. You don't know, uh, Thunderbolt. Bye-bye, Electrode. Ooh, a crit. Nice. Oh, yeah, another thing. Electrode? He's bulky. Because of, you know, what I just finished saying. I'm pretty sure Mulk... M Mulk... Muck... Is super bulky. Because of the special thing. But then again, he's always bulky. So I guess he can attack. I don't know. I don't really know the stats of every single Pokemon. Ooh, Pokeball. Ooh, Calcium. I know who I'm giving that to. Alright. Drink up, goat. I'm, you know what, since I forgot, I'm just gonna look at Puff's stats really quick. Yeah, see? In this game, she, she has a higher attack than special attack. I'm pretty sure that changes later on, but I don't know. I checked the... Okay, we have three more minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and go and heal Magneton. Check his HP. He has 13. I'm going to give you a super potion just in case. What am I saying just in case? Of course you're going to need it. Alright. Everyone, if you want, shut your eyes and I'll tell you when we're out of here. Because I don't want your eyes hurting so much. We're in the elevator. Going to floor one. We. We're passing the passing the fountain that looks like something else. You guys ever noticed there's like two? I'm pretty sure there's two doors out of Silfco. I think there's one on the left side and one on the right. I don't know, but I think so. And there's only one door. If I'm wrong, oh well. If I'm right, pretty weird, huh? Alright. You can look now. Alright everyone, that's going to be the end of today's video. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you feel like it. Please comment what you want to see me do next, because I have no idea what I should do. And that'll be it from me. May the Magikarps be with you, and all that jazz.